hello students in today's lecture i will discuss about computer graphics and applications computer graphics is the creation of pictures with the help of computer the end product of computer graphics is a picture it may be a business graph drawing and engineering it is the use of computers to create and manipulate pictures on a display device it comprises of software techniques to create store modify and represents picture now in computer graphics what we are doing we are creating the picture with the help of uh, computer system and uh, after creating the picture we can also manipulate that picture and finally the objective is to display that picture on the output screen it can be a crt screen it can be an led screen or any other display device now the computer graphics can be it can be a uh, interactive computer graphics also in interactive computer graphics the user can interact with the computer system that means interactive computer graphics involves a two way communication between computer and user here the observer is given some control over the image by providing him with an input device for example the video game controller so in this the user is interacting with the computer system he can provide inputs uh, to the system and uh, by those inputs uh, he can control the motion of the picture like we are playing games so we could able to control the movement of uh, any object in the in the game so it is a kind of interactive computer graphics now there are so many application areas of computer graphics so the applications of computer graphics are in education and training the computer generated model of the physical financial and economic system is often used as educational aids so we can uh, use computer graphics in uh, for education and training purpose also and uh, you can see uh, the faculty members are teaching the students through the use of uh, ppts uh, by making videos so it is all computer graphics then computer generated maps town planners and transportation engineers can use computer generated maps which display data useful to them in their planning work then we can use computer graphics as computer art computer graphics graphics are also used in the field of commercial arts it is used to generate television and advertising commercials then in education software computer graphics is used in the development of education software for making computer aided instructions then we can also use computer graphics in printing technology computer graphics is used for printing technology and textile design so you can see that there are so many application areas of computer graphics another application or area of computer graphics is cat that is computer aided design so you can see in the figure by using cad we can design the structure of a building we can design maps we can design the parts of automobiles and after designing we can easily visualize these things so designing of buildings automobile aircraft is done with the help of computer aided drawing this helps in providing minute details to the drawing and producing more accurate and sharp drawings with better specifications then we can also apply computer graphics in presentation graphics so here you can see there are so many diagrams are given the scientists are conducting various experiments 
that means the scientific experiments are conducted by the scientist and lots of amount of data has been generated by them and this data can be visualized with the help of computer graphics visualization visualization techniques are another approach for interpreting large data sets providing insights that might be missed by statistical models or methods so you can see that we could able to draw uh, various graphs uh, through the data which is uh, generated through scientific experiments creation of bar graphs pie charts time chart can be done using the tools present in computer graphics so by using computer graphics we could able to produce uh, different graphs or charts and it could help us to visualize the data then we can also use computer graphics uh, for entertainment purpose computer graphics finds a major part of its utility in the movie industry and game industry so we can see that there are so many movies are coming which are having animations and uh, so many three dimension 3d movies are coming and all these movies are the part of computer graphics it is uh, used for creating motion pictures music videos television shows cartoon animation films so the creation of uh, uh, various uh, 3d movies cartoon movies or animation movies all these are the part of computer graphics so the next application of computer graphics is virtual reality and virtual reality is the use of computer technology to create a simulated environment so you can see that uh, in the figures a virtual environment has been created and uh, for the user it seems like he is working in the actual environment and uh, this uh, uh, virtual reality could help for the training purpose now there are so many graphics packages are available through which uh, we could perform graphics operations by making use of these software packages we could able to create uh, pictures we could manipulate the pictures we could able to create animations so the various packages are logo corel draw autocad 3d studio four gks that is a graphics kernel system then phigs then cam that is the computer graphics uh, meta file then cgi computer graphics interface graphics hardware there are so many graphics hardwares we are dealing like uh, mouse to navigate the things then we are having the output device like monitor then we could have ram random access memory and if the machine is having high ram then certainly it will speed up the operation then we are having the cpu that is the central processing unit uh, to process the graphics then for storage we are having hard disk and ssd that is a solid state drive then we could have digital camera it could be used to capture the pictures or videos then uh, for output we could have a printer it is used to print out pictures or documents then we could have a scanner used to scan photos or documents into a computer then for data transfer we could have usb but graphics tablet used to navigate around graphics software or to enhance manipulate or create digital images so this is all about today's uh, lecture thank you